are in Douglas Channel at the end, just off of Kitimat Village, uh, which is very near the town of Kitimat as well. And we're quite fortunate that it stopped raining for this operation today. Uh, this is the uh, Smart Ocean Systems instrument platform deployment out of Kitimat Village. We're just preparing cables now and uh, getting ready to approach the shore where we'll pass the cable end off to uh, staff on the shore. who will secure it and then give us the uh, the go ahead to lay the cable out. It's a 400 meter length and at the end of that cable when we get there at about a depth of 40 meters we'll attach an instrument platform, lower it to the seabed and release it. Yeah, so basically we're at the final stage now before we put the platform down. On the shore end, they're plugging in the connector that attaches the subsea cable to a cable that's in the vault, which is the small buried chamber where we ran the cable down the foreshore. Uh, once that's plugged in, uh, at that end, uh, Ryan Key on the shore will head up to the shore station and, and wait for our call. Okay, we're going we're gonna to move to deploy then. Thanks, Ryan. Once we plug in the connectors here at the instrument platform, we'll do a quick uh, deck test to confirm uh, general functionality of the instrument platform. And then once we have confirmation of that, we'll power it down again and we'll put it over the side. We'll lower it down to the seabed and release it with an acoustic release. And then give Ryan the opportunity again to power it up from the shore station and confirm once again that uh, everything is doing what it's supposed to be doing. It might be cool if you can turn the lights on when the RV gets down. That might make for more interesting footage. Okay, that's great. A camera forward, right? Yeah, that's probably best. We're just pulling away from the shore now, having completed the uh, ROV survey of both the instrument platform and of how the cable is laid on the seabed. We actually managed with the ROV to uh, chase the cable all the way back to the steel pipe that the others on shore had put in place so that we could really see uh, exactly where the cable went and we could see that it was secure all the way up the pipe to the shore station, so which was a pretty positive development. Uh, so now we're essentially, that completes the uh, installation here and it's a bit of cleanup and then we'll be heading back to, to shore, a little cleanup at the shore station and then we'll be moving on to the Prince Rupert sites.